Hi, this is Mr. West, and today we're doing a football World Cup Cartesian art coordinates worksheet tutorial from mathdrills.com. Make sure to check out the link in the description below. Tons of great resources, great website. So the premise of this video is gonna be making a picture that's related to the World Cup using coordinates. So these coordinates have an X and Y coordinate, two different coordinates, and it plots a certain point on the coordinate plane. Now, one thing you need to know is there is an X and Y coordinate. The first number is the X, and the second number is the Y. So if it's a positive X, it'll move to the right. A negative X will move it to the left. Positive Y will move it up, and a negative Y will move it down. So these are the different coordinates here. There's only two lines that you're gonna have. You're gonna connect all these points in the first section, and that's gonna create a shape. And then the second shape, you're gonna do the same thing in it. You're gonna see that it loops back to the original um, coordinate. So there's negative 10, 10 for the first one in that line one. And then again, negative 10, 10 at the end. So how do we do this? Well, the first one, like I said, is negative 10, 10. So that means we're gonna go left 10 and then we're gonna go up because the negative X moves us to the left and then a positive Y will move us up. So uh, let me go ahead and plot that point just so you can see what it looks like. So let's go down here. This is our coordinate plane. And we're gonna plot that point. So negative 10 for the X, and then there's a positive 10 for the Y, and we're gonna see where they meet, and we're gonna put a point right there. So you can see I put a point right there, and then that's my first point, okay? And I'm gonna keep doing this. So just a couple notes. If we have the 0, 20, as I'm trying to zoom in there. Okay, so 0, 20, we're just gonna go up 20. The, the zero for the X means we don't go either left nor right. Okay, and then right below that we have positive 14, negative 21. That means I'm gonna go right 14 units and then down 21 units, okay? So every combination you're gonna see, there's, you know, you have positive X, negative Y, uh, negative X, negative Y, okay? Bunch of different uh, possibilities here and we're gonna see that it creates a picture. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna go ahead and plot these for you and you can follow along. I'm gonna go really fast though. You can pause, rewind at any time. But I'm gonna go ahead and plot up these points. Let's check it out. Okay, so I'm done with line one and I plotted my first point for line two. And you're gonna see that we have what appears to be a football player, soccer for those Americans that are watching. And I'm gonna go ahead and finish up this next thing. I bet you can probably guess what it is. Hey, it's a soccer ball. Okay, so that's how we complete this one. And I wanna show you that once you're done, yeah, this looks great, but you can really add some flair to it. And I'm gonna show you the completed one that I have up here after you color it. So I colored it in and I think it looks way better once you do that. So make sure to spend a little extra time, add some uh, you know, customization to it, makes it look really cool. So this is something that you can do in class or outside of class, it'd be a lot of fun. One other note, I wanna show you guys that in Math Drills, you can follow along with the World Cup. So we have World Cup group staging, uh, group stage tracking chart here, groups A to D, and there's also more below. So if you guys wanted to follow along with all the World Cup scores and goals and the group stage, this is the perfect little template that you can use to follow along with all the action, because this is one of the most exciting times of the year. The whole world is watching. So make sure to have a little bit more involvement with this cool worksheet, which is also on Math Drills. I'm gonna link it in the description below. So that's all the time we have for today. I hope you enjoyed this video. Make sure to check out more videos from Math Drills on my channel. I have a playlist dedicated to Math Drills content, and I look forward to seeing you next time right here on West Explains Best.